Hey everybody, this is Brandon from Better At Everything. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to use a built-in feature in AutoCAD to print your drawings to a PDF. Uh, this is an easy way to send a client a drawing or to see how it's going to plot out when you print this, the real thing. It's also uh, a little bit easier on the paper consumption, so when you're making edits and stuff, you just print them to PDF. You can check it out. It should be pretty much what's going to show up when you print it from your plotter or your printer. Um, it's also the easiest way to send drawings over the internet for review and check, um, especially since Adobe is free and pretty much everybody has it or can download it easily. So here we go. I've got a blank new drawing. Um, let's just draw a couple circles or something. Here we go. This circle and a polyline. Just do a little scribble here. Close that up. Enter. All right, here's our drawing. We're going to go to uh, eight and a half by eleven landscape. Let's do it like that. Uh, these title blocks, by the way, uh, you can buy on my website, Better at Everything, in the resources section. Uh, it's along the top tabs. Um, they come with uh, drawing template files, which are preset up with all these tabs in the correct sizes and with the title block, and there's different ones to choose from. Uh, so don't forget to check those out. Anyway, so we've got our drawing here. To print to PDF, you're going to right-click on the tab that you're in and go Page Setup Manager. This is to set up your printing setup. So we're going to leave it on the default one, which is the, the uh, tab we've got open, and hit Modify. Now you can select the name of your printer. Now the trick here is to print to PDF, there's a built-in drawing to PDF printer driver, which is drawing to PDF.pc3. Now if you have Adobe installed, uh, you may already have an Adobe option. You can choose that, and I prefer that one. But if you don't have a PDF writer installed, use the drawing to PDF driver. It's uh, free, and pretty much everybody should have that with uh, AutoCAD. Now over here you can choose your plot style uh, table. Um, I'm just going to leave it on ACAD. Uh, you should end up with just a black and white drawing that way. Make sure all your settings are correct. Um, full bleed, you want extents, whatever. That's your, up to you. You can even preview it. That's what your drawing is going to look like. So once you hit OK and close that window, you can right click and plot or you can type in plot or from the AutoCAD menu you can hit the print button right there. Um, you're going to make sure everything's right. It shows the drawing to PDF printer. We're going to hit OK. It's going to ask us where we want to save that. We're just going to type in example drawing DWG. There you go. Hit save. We've saved it into that folder and it's done. You can see down here the bubble popped up. No errors or warnings. So now we're going to open up the folder where we saved our PDF to double check it. And as you can see, example drawing.pdf, you double click, opens up, and there it is. You can see what it looks like. You can see if it turned out the way you think it's going to, if the colors are working right. It's really easy. Another nice thing is that drawing to PDF includes the layers in your drawing and allows you to turn them on and off in the PDF file. Very useful for clients and for complicated drawings. So if you look along the left here, you can turn on or off uh, anything. So you can turn off layer zero, which is where I drew those lines. You can turn off your office logo, which you can see in the title block there, uh, north arrow, project, whatever you want, scale bar pieces. Anyway, so there you have it. You've created a PDF for free without downloading any add-ons from AutoCAD 2012. If you have any questions, feel free to ask in the comments, and don't forget to check out my site, betteratteverything.info, and subscribe to me on YouTube. You can do that just below the video. Thanks for watching. Cheers.